You know, in the States, we think of a mongrel as like a mangy dog, so it's kind of hard for me to think of, you know, like a steely person that, you know, you're, you're going to have a hard time, uh, you know, getting up against. But, you know, back in the day, it, I would have to say it's Dottie Pepper. Um, I think when I played in uh, the Solheim Cup in 2009, when I played against Helen Alfredson, you know, she's a, a true grinder. I think Stacey Keating. Stacey Keating is a, um, a massive grinder. Um, even if she's not having the best of days, she'll grind it out and get a great, great score. And, and you know, it, it's great watching Stacey play. Right now, the most mongrel on course had to be Lydia Ko. Oh, that's it. That is a tough question. Um, can I pass? <laughs> um, maybe Stacey Keating. I'd say uh, when she was playing, Rachel Hetherington had the most mongrel in her. She actually has a really great record against Annika Sorensen in playoffs. I don't think Annika's ever beaten her in a playoff, and I think they've played three or four playoffs. So um, Rach definitely had a lot of mongrel in her and got a lot out of her game. I'd probably have to say Rachel Hetherington. Uh, there's a lot of tough people on tour. Um, I suppose if I, if I were to pick a handful, I would say Anna Nordquist, uh, she, she's got this look about her. She wants to get the ball in the hole as fast as she can. Um, and I'd have to say with Kari too. She doesn't typically uh, deviate too much from her game plan and focus. I think uh, Carlotta Saganda has the most mongrel out there. I wouldn't like to be coming down the stretch with her, I think. Um, I think the person with the most mongrel would be, I'm not too sure, we don't really play a lot of match play. Um, uh, I probably wouldn't like to play against someone like Paula Creamer. Definitely Julia Boland. I feel like the veterans um, are less phased by things, so probably the veterans, um, but in a good way, it's a positive. Ugolf.com, get involved.